Okay, here's the fuel rail. Um, right back here, this is the actual fuel line coming from the tank. Um, remember that the fuel tank is completely sealed and it has a pressure pump in it, a high pressure fuel pump. And so it's shoving pressurized fuel into this line, into this coupler. Um, there's actually a disconnect coupler right here for servicing purposes if you have to disconnect the fuel rail. Um, the fuel rail itself is under, well, it's under this cover, but it's basically a continuous, actually, sorry, it's right here underneath this whole tray that has some uh, harnesses on it. So in this case, the fuel rail is rectangular. Uh, right down under here, that is a fuel injector, and that's a fuel injector, and that's a fuel injector, and way under there is another fuel injector. And then this uh, series of wiring harnesses are actually uh, signal wires that go to and from the fuel injectors. So, and they're, you know, kind of hard to see back in behind here. Um, but uh, basically, the fuel injector receives the signal from the PCM uh, for the uh, dwell time for how long it should spray fuel. And this is also a port fuel injection system. So if you see this intake runner here, um, right at the base of it, right where it goes into the cylinder head down here, that's where the fuel injector is going to be spraying. And then this intake runner here is feeding down in, and that one sprays right in just before that uh, goes into the head uh, by the intake valves. Um, it all works the same way all the way across. Okay, um, It's a little more exposed on this vehicle. It's actually kind of nice and easy to see.